Hello there. My name is Jason Stevenson, and welcome to tonight's guided meditation to help calm the mind and release anxious thoughts. In tonight's meditation, I'll provide you with guidance to witness anxious thought streams, to surrender to them, and to return to your inner peace. Whoever you are, no matter what you are experiencing, you are welcome here. We will move through this process slowly and gently, and you'll be given plenty of time to shift and soften any anxiety that is present for you. During this practice, you are encouraged to drift off to sleep whenever slumber comes naturally for you. So we will begin by taking a few moments to settle in through breath and body awareness. And then I will guide you to a comfortable place in the middle of a tranquil forest, an environment that will further help you to let go. And so before we begin, take a moment to find a comfortable laying down position that will be supportive of deep sleep when the time comes. Just allow your spine to lengthen and your limbs to soften as you feel into how gravity is holding you here right now. Closing your eyes whenever you feel ready. And take a moment to check in with your physical body. Just inquire with your body about whether you might need anything else in this moment. Perhaps a pillow, a blanket, a pair of socks or any other adjustment. And when you're ready, find a comfortable position of relative stillness. You don't need to aim for complete stillness as your body is always in subtle motion anyways. But see if you can surrender as much as you can into non-doing. Knowing that you are always free to make adjustments as you need to throughout the practice. And turn your attention towards the breath for a few moments now, just minding its natural rhythm as it moves through your body. And for the next few breath cycles, refrain from changing the breath in any way. Simply allow it to flow naturally while also considering the fact that each full breath cleanses and nourishes and supports you. Each breath in restores your blood of the oxygen it requires. And each breath out emits what no longer serves you. And now I invite you to take three deep breaths at your own pace, beginning whenever you are ready, and inhaling to the furthest depth that is still comfortable for you. And then exhale, maybe releasing a soft sigh or anything else that yearns to be let go of. Inhale completely and exhale what you no longer need. A 
after your third deep breath, just continue to breathe naturally. And then take a moment to re-ground into the surface supporting you. And just take note of each part of your body that is in contact with your bed and noting the sensation of fabric against your skin. And before we move into the forest inside your mind, just take a moment to offer a word of gratitude for the place that holds you right now. Make a note of any aspects of your environment that you can be thankful for in this very moment. And when you're finished, turn towards the creative center within your own mind. And through your mind, I invite you to travel consciously now finding yourself in a brilliant forest held beneath the warm, late summer sun. You are standing on a narrow footpath of aromatic amber soil, and on either side of you, majestic trees stretch up towards the beaming cosmos. The wind is warm as it brushes just gently against your cheeks. Standing here in the wilderness of these woods, your shoulders begin to soften and drop. This forest sanctuary comes to you as a refuge away from the weight of the world. From all that you felt you needed to carry in the days up until now. For these precious moments I invite you to grant yourself permission to let go, to simply tune into what is right here and to open up to the possibility of deep release and inner peace. As you grant yourself this permission, you know that you don't need to force yourself to feel any different than you do right now. And furthermore, know that opening up to inner peace does not mean that all of your outer world challenges will disappear. However, consider that there is a chance of finding respite beneath the waves of the worried mind. Know only that this peace and tranquility is possible, opening your heart to the journey that guides you there. Now take a moment to feel into your body here in the forest as you witness yourself acclimatizing to your new environment. Perhaps you might see yourself stretch your arms up towards the sky or reaching down to the earth in reverence. Witness yourself moving in any way that helps to free up and release stagnant or anxious energy within your body. Eventually you return to standing, gazing down the trail stretched out before you. The path ahead is whimsical, weaving in and out of the old growth forest. You take a long, deep breath, inhaling the forest air. 
And as you exhale, you begin on your way, taking the trail mindful, step by step. As you go, you absorb the beauty of the forest around you. Hummingbirds flitter through the air, and squirrels and chipmunks jump from treetop to treetop. Ancient ferns rise up from the earth in their cosmic patterns, and countless other species of plants and animals make themselves known to you. In fact, the diversity is beyond anything you've ever seen. Take a moment to explore the environment for yourself as you walk through it. Allow it to come to life with any plants, animals or even insects that bring you a sense of peace and well-being. Consider the fact that your inner forest is completely unique to your own mind and imagination and bring it to life in any way that soothes you. In other words, plant your inner refuge as you please. As you witness the peace that lives in this forest, notice how a sense of ease grows inside of you. Notice your belly softening, your limbs relaxing, and your worried or controlling mind letting go even further. Breath. By breath, by breath. Simply just being in this forest provides you with something you. It helps you to naturally and effortlessly begin the process of letting go. Now, soften your gaze on the plants and animals of this forest. As you focus once again on the trail ahead of you. As you do, you notice that this pathway ends just a few meters up ahead. And where it does, there is a small clearing in the woods. You make your way towards the clearing which enchants your heart and mind completely. It's surrounded by tall, ancient trees, with wildflowers lining the perimeter. Teal, violet and fuchsia petals are in full bloom. The soil in the clearing is bare, but it's still rich and full of invisible energy. And in the center of it, a tiny nest of sorts has been laid out for you. A Persian rug is spread across the solid earth, and on top of it, plush cushions and blankets are scattered. This human-like nest in the middle of the forest has your name on it, and so you make yourself cosy within it.
as you come to rest your back on the soft rug in the middle of the forest, wriggling your body to get comfortable. You take a few deep breaths to settle in and softening your belly as you breathe. With each breath in, you embrace the vitality of the forest around you. And with each outward breath, you feel yourself melting a little bit further into the earth. Each breath brings you back to what is right here, back to the peace that is possible when you connect with what is present. You continue to breathe naturally as you gaze out at the world from the surface of the earth. Those majestic trees stand even taller, with canopies that dance through the glistening sun. The trees are alive. You can feel their energy. And you embrace their shelter, their stability, and their protection. Now, gazing up at the canopy, you see that there is enough open space for the sunlight to pour through. As it does, it blesses your entire body. Not only does it offer you its warmth, it offers ease and release as well. To further soothe the mind, you tune in more closely to the physical body as it rests beneath this glorious sun. You begin by drawing your attention towards your crown, feeling the golden light of this radiant star penetrating, opening, and softening the uppermost part of you. This light begins to seep downwards, relaxing all the muscles around your eyes. It disarms the flow of any repetitive and unhelpful thought patterns. You exhale to release surrendering your mind to the cleansing power of this light. And then you feel the sun's rays inch further down, filling and relaxing your jaw, your tongue, and your throat. You take a long, Deep breath into this golden light, feeling at ease any tension you've been carrying in and around this part of you. Still resting on the forest floor, you feel into the sun's light as it enters your shoulders and then as it slowly seeps into your upper arms, your elbows and lower arms, and into your hands. As this metallic yellow light fills you from shoulders to fingertips, you feel your arms let go. You feel them surrender. 
you know that there is nothing you need to latch onto, nothing you need to fix, to grasp, or to sort out. You just grant your arms permission to surrender. The light from your shoulders now enters into your upper torso. Your lower back melts. It surrenders. And your heart space opens up to the universal light that touches it. As you breathe, life force moves into and out of your heart with complete ease. And then the golden light seeps even further downwards, tracing the length of your spine until it lands in the center of your belly. As you breathe here, Feel your belly filling with radiant sunlight. It dissolves all tension, all contraction, and all worry, helping you to breathe a little deeper. At the same time, your lower back begins to soften as well. Coming into deeper and deeper peace here in the forest where you rest, you witness as the sun's glow enters your pelvic region now. And as it does, your hips begin to unknot. Tension begins to melt, seeping into the earth beneath you for renewal. And finally the golden light of the sun begins to inch its way down your legs. First it fills your upper legs, relaxing all of these muscles completely. Then it flows down to your knees, into your calves and shins. and eventually into your feet, into each and every toe. Feel both of your legs surrendering with the support of the light shining down from above you. Waves of calm pulse through your entire body. Follow them for a moment now, witnessing them as currents of golden light ebbing and flowing from the top of your head to your toes. And then from your toes to the top of your head and back again. As this golden wave of calm rises up to your crown, it eases your mind and connects you to everything around you. And as it ebbs back towards your feet, it grounds you deep into the earth, providing you with a sense of strength and resilience.
The sun's rays continue to hold you as you tune in to other elements of the forest now. First, you notice the sweet aroma that fills your nostrils as you breathe. You absorb the aliveness of the forest with each full breath. Then your eyes trace the lengths of those remarkable trees which are firmly rooted, calm and stable. You admire the base of the trees and the intricate pattern of their bark. And then your gaze rises up them, noticing the complexity of branches that extend out from the solid, stable core. The leaves on those upper branches are diverse and varied. Even from down below you can see that some are round, some are triangular, and some are irregular, like the leaves of the chestnut trees and the maples. Just together, they dance seamlessly in the soft breeze. Occasionally, you witness a leaf splitting from its branch and dancing down towards the earth. You admire how effortlessly it lets go, how naturally it surrenders. As you gaze up at the leaves, you realize how transient they are. Seasons come and seasons go, and throughout the seasons, the trees shed their leaves in order to be renewed. And so you liken the leaves above you to the thoughts that come and go for seasons in your mind. Anxious or worried thoughts are just as transient as those delicate leaves that shimmer in the wind. And so, as you rest here beneath the canopy, Pair each falling leaf with an anxious, ruminating or worried thought that you would like to release or soften. As one of these thoughts come to mind, see it falling towards the rich and fertile earth as a delicate leaf does at the end of its season. As each leaf of anxiety or worry falls towards the earth, something remarkable happens. Time appears to speed up in your mind's eye as you watch each fallen leaf transmute from vibrant green to deep red to dark rust. And quickly, as if you were watching time-lapsed film, you observe each leaf decay, becoming one with the bed of soil it rests on. Continue to watch this miraculous process of transformation on your own. Link each anxious thought with a falling leaf. And as it arrives on the earth, watch as alchemy takes over. What begins as a worried, delicate leaf fluttering in the wind of life is capable of transforming, of becoming rich, dense soil through the ever-present possibility of transformation.
Remember that your body is a tool to facilitate release. With each thought that surrenders to the earth, allow the body to surrender as well. By relaxing your body, you encourage the mind to do the same. Any and all sorts of anxious thoughts can be processed in this way. So long as the cause of your concern does not require urgent action in this moment, it's possible to tap into a sense of surrender. And to let go of anxious thoughts does not mean we don't care about certain outcomes or that we are in denial of how we feel. Rather, it's a simple recognition that the past cannot be returned to, that the future is undetermined, and that all we have is the present moment. And in this present moment, we can choose to open ourselves up to deeper peace. You continue to rest on the forest floor, bundled up as the sun moves behind the canopy now. The air is still warm, and so you are completely comfortable. Take a few more moments of silence to watch leaves of anxious thoughts fall towards the earth. Watch them quickly and effortlessly turn into dried leaves and then into soil itself. Your eyes are growing tired, but you continue to absorb the tranquility of the world around you. Here, amongst the plants, insects and trees, you realise that anxiety is not a concern. The various beings that call this forest home simply go about their lives. They know what needs to be done, and they do it. And the rest, they leave. An awareness grows within you that nature doesn't need to worry. Yes, there are times when it must leap into action to protect itself. But it doesn't over-ruminate. It doesn't overthink. This recognition alone helps you to breathe deeper. Helps you to further surrender. You come back to your breathing, feeling the natural rhythm of this cycle moving through you, just like the seasons. The breath comes and it goes. It comes and it goes. You feel yourself surrendering deeper to this universal wisdom of the breath. You realize that there is indeed an innate universal force that is holding you and supporting you. You realize now that you do not need to do, nor do you, accomplish everything on your own. And so, if you'd like to, I invite you now to ask the universal energy all around you for any support 
that you need for a final release. In other words, is there something that you are still struggling to let go of? Something that you need support with? And if so, turn towards the sky that seeps through the canopy overhead and ask for its wisdom, for its support. If you hear a wise voice offer its support to you, know that not only does it come from the universe around you, it comes simultaneously from inside your very own being. You are the holder of the wisdom that you seek. For a few more silent moments, Come back to the falling leaves. Let any thoughts that do not serve you be surrendered now. Allow the universe and your inherent wisdom to support you with this. If it feels natural for you, you might even tap into a sense of joy as you observe the falling leaves. Letting go doesn't always have to be difficult. Often there is joy in release. Now you can tell by the movement of shadows that the sun is beginning its final departure. The forest appears to be preparing for a good night's rest. Animals have slowed their stirring. Butterflies have retreated for the night. And all that remains in their place is near stillness. As the earth slows down, so do you. The mind, which had already experienced a sense of quiet tranquility, slows even further. You are beginning to pass into the state between wakefulness and sleep. But before you drift off completely, you continue to take in the radiance of the world around you, namely the colours in this evening sky. First, the sky illuminates with a soft, clementine orange glow. It doesn't quite reach the uppermost cosmos, but the horizon casts its light through the surrounding trees. This radiant orange light floats across your body, granting you warmth and balance and vitality. From head to toe, you open yourself up to it completely. Soon the orange light in the sky begins to transmute. Electric magenta begins to shine through in its place. As it covers your body, it grants you a sense of childlike wonder, magic and trust. Open your heart to this enchanting pink glow.
the light in the sky continues to shift. Soon, the once pink glow becomes a deep, mesmerizing violet. A color associated with wisdom, spiritual connection, and the soothing of emotions. You feel yourself coming into complete alignment as this violet light passes over you. All of your cells, all of your muscles, your nerve endings, and all of your organs are touched by this cleansing, radiant light. It fills your entire body, from the tips of your toes to the crown of your head. And as it fills your mind space, it dispels any last ruminating thought patterns that may have been stubbornly holding on. You don't need to bring them with you into the slumber ahead. The dark violet colour grows deeper, soon becoming a midnight blue. You can still make out the night sky against the black silhouette of trees overhead. And through that empty space that exposes you to the cosmos, the Milky Way begins to appear. The thick blanket of stars is mesmerising. You feel completely safe and supported here in the forest. Somehow, as the day has departed and the midnight hour creeps closer, you have gained an embodied sense of belonging. You feel a part of this forest, a part of this entire earth and universe, in fact. And it is this deep sense of belonging that awakens your inner peace. Worried thoughts may still rise from time to time, but you've gained a new perspective of them. Here, gazing out at the Milky Way, you realize that, in fact, you are not looking out at the stars. You are a part of them. And being a part of the universe like this, you are unconditionally supported through everything. You are unconditionally loved. Sink into this deeper understanding of your belonging for a few long, deep breaths. If you'd like to, you might want to release a soft sigh with each exhalation. If any worries or anxious thoughts creep back, know that you hold the power to release and to soften them. Just refrain from judging these thoughts or pushing them away. Simply acknowledge them as a part of yourself that simply needs your love and compassion. Grant them your love. Let them know how strong you are. And then allow these unhelpful thoughts just to fade away. Through the canopy above, you catch sight of the moon making itself known to the dark sky. 
tonight it is a waning crescent moon, fading into darkness day by day by day. And this waning moon offers a final reminder to surrender. It invites you to make space by cleansing the old so that you may set new intentions and new belief systems to empower you in the days to come. So, as you gaze up at the radiant silver of the moon, take a moment to consider what intention you'd like to set for the day that awaits you. What qualities or ways of being would you like to harness while you sleep and carry into tomorrow? Once you have your intention, silently repeat it to the moon three times. Release your words of intention when you've finished your third repetition and sinking back into the silent stillness of the evening forest. Feel back into your breath observing once again its continual coming and going. And as you breathe, listen closely. See if you can hear the sound that it makes. If you can hear it, liken this sound to the soft flow of wind through a tranquil forest canopy like the one overhead of you now. You close your eyes and once again you can feel your body being penetrated with soothing light energy. This time, it's not the sun it is the subtlety of the moon. And so, eyes closed to the forest around you, you feel into the silver light of this moon. First, it weaves its way into the crown and headspace, reminding you to let go again and again, and again, as many times as is needed. It then ebbs its way into your cheeks, your mouth, and your throat, helping to release your jaw and anything you've been clenching onto there. You then feel the moon's glow moving into your shoulders, and as it does, you release your shoulders into the earth. Words of the Indian scholar and environmental activist Vandana Shiva come to mind. You hear her whisper. You are not Atlas carrying the world on your shoulders. It is good to remember that the planet is carrying you.
Now the silver light seeps into the full lengths of your arms, just as the sun did all those moments ago. The silver light brings deep release to each of your muscles, from those in your shoulders all the way down to your fingers. Let them go. Let each of those muscles surrender for the night. You trace the silver light back up and into your chest now, where it creates a sense of spaciousness. Your heart area illuminates with bright silver light and it grows with each inhalation. If any thoughts arise from now on, you can guide them into this luminescent heart for transformation. Now the silver thread of light weaves its way along your spine. Each vertebrae that it passes surrenders to the evening. And eventually your stomach fills with this subtle silver glow. And feel your breath as it moves into this space. The silver glow expanding in your belly with each full breath. And it softens all areas around your core, front and back, side to side. This calming silver energy enters into your hips and pelvis, bringing softness to this part of you one last time before sleep. And then it weaves its way through your upper legs, past your knees, into your lower legs, ending its journey at the tips of your toes. Just allow both legs to relax in their entirety. Take a few full breaths as you bathe in this silver light of the moon. And if you find that there's any specific part of you that longs for a little more silver light energy, draw your attention there. Let it fill to the brim with the light of the moon. And when you are ready, let the imagery of this silver light soften now. The moon is still there, high up in the night sky. But you can shift your attention to any other anchor that feels soothing for you. Perhaps you focus on the breath. Inhaling and exhaling the fresh, nourishing air. Perhaps you focus on what it feels like to be held against the earth by gravity. What it feels like for each part of your body to fully surrender. Each muscle to fully relax into the surface beneath you. Perhaps you gaze up at the Milky Way, at the tops of the trees, 
or at some other point in nature that soothes and settles you. Just whatever brings you a sense of peace, presence and well-being, let that be your anchor for a short while longer. And slowly now, I invite you to release the imagery of the forest from your mind as you gently shift your awareness back to this physical reality. Keep your mind soft. You've not physically gone anywhere and so you don't need to return. You've always been here. You've always been held by this space the entire time. If you are still with me, I trust that sleep will be coming soon for you. Between now and then, use whatever anchor you please to keep your attention focused and your mind calm. The peace and tranquility you experienced here tonight was not a product of anything outside of yourself. It came from within. Remember this deeper truth any time the mind seems to wander off on its own. Remember that you hold the power in all moments, in all breaths to bring yourself back to peace. The seeds of your inner forest refuge are always there, always available to be tuned into. Good night, my friend. Good night. <laughs>